Hello, I'm Debbie Bell Hosking and welcome to Finextra. With me is Frederick Inze of Oakham and we're discussing the alternative lending market. Hello, Frederick. Hello, Debbie. Frederick, the short to medium term lending market is evolving. What is driving that change? The need and expectation of consumer are still about being able to be accepted for a small amount of money. Uh, no application or very short application form with quick decision. And uh, this market was traditionally served by overdraft and credit card. The change has been the fact that larger group of consumers are now taking part in the gig economy and as a result are facing uncertainty in their income. Traditional lenders, credit card and banks, do not know how to face, and, uh, face that demand. So how are these new lending options improving life for the customer? What we're finding is that um, the first change is to do with the ability to take information that is complex and unstructured. And we're seeing a model that are much more about exchange of information with consumer. And you know, you're seeing, for example, lenders that are taking into account uh, your data on Facebook you know, versus just your credit report. The second change has been the fact that uh, more and more consumers want to be able to access the solution at the touch of a button on their smart smartphone. And the third change is the fact that consumers want to be in the driving seat. And we're seeing as an example of the last uh, change is um, student loans in the US, SoFi or Common Bond, who are offering uh, products that are go, go much deeper into the life of consumer, offering a loan, but also offering support and forbearance at time of an employment. So talking about technology, what are the key technologies being leveraged by new entrants and how is that technology powering new lending models? Actually, technology has been the key enabler for these new emerging models. Um, new entrants can benefit from, number one, the ability to create distribution without having the huge fixed costs traditionally linked to this to distribution of financial service. So smartphone is the key solution to distribution. Second one is the ability to gather and process data and much larger set, much more in structured set of data than before. This is changing the, the Chris call card model and inventing new ways to underwrite the right consumer. And the last one, as I mentioned earlier, putting the consumer in the driving seat is the, the whole emergence of the mobile app and the ability to get consumer to uh, act and seeing the reaction from lenders. So the example I took earlier of the uh, student loan in the US, some of the um, players in that market are offering tips on how to improve your credit so you can, after finishing your loan, access your first car loan and your first mortgage by doing certain things that will improve your credit scorecard. Frederick, thank you so much for your insight on the alternative lending market. Thank you, Debbie. And thank you for watching.